Hello and welcome to SnowRunner News and I have an update for you. I'm UK Gamer 808 and today I can confirm the Chevrolet Apache is in SnowRunner game finally. So we were all thinking it was coming out 8.0 and what have you, but no. It's paid content. If you have the season pass, you still have to pay extra to own it, which is a, a bit naughty, I thought, but that's the reason they were they kept it all under wraps because it's paid content. So I've just picked this up in the PlayStation Store and I presume it will be available in the Xbox Store and the same for PC. It should be available wherever you normally buy it from. It should be all there to buy. Now, I had to pay £3.24 for this, which... Uh, little bit of a con I think that is especially when you pay for the season pass as well and then they're putting in these extra vehicles which you've got to pay for but at least we've got it now I've had a quick little look at it and it seems to go all right it's not completely overpowered or anything I've only tried it with a basic engine I will go and do a review on this as soon as I've finished this video we're going to have a quick look at it and see what it's all about but that's the latest news for you the Chevrolet Apache is available now so go and get it if you want to spend some money because it will cost you some money. There's no free, you're not getting anything free from SnowRunner with the Apache. Got to pay for it. Righto, that's it for a quick update on SnowRunner news. I hope you enjoyed this episode and if you did, I will see you on the next one.